In a recent poll of UWO and Fanshawe students, 287 out of 400 reported drinking Tim Hortons coffee once or more per day. I went around Fanshawe's campus to talk to students about what makes this their coffee of choice. Tim Hortons was founded in 1964 in Hamilton, Ontario by hockey player Tim Horton and his business partner. Since then it has become a Canadian legend and Canada's largest fast food service. You could brew coffee at home for a lot less, so what brings heaps of students to one of the three Tim Hortons on Fanshawe's campus day after day? For one, it's one of the only ones in the college, uh, specifically for college students as well. I find that we're faster than a lot of coffee shops. It's not as much about the coffee experience, uh, just more of a delivery mechanism for caffeine and sugar, you know. People, students have a lot of work to do, they don't have time to wait for coffee. And for some students, going to Tim Hortons isn't just a cup of java, it's a way of life. How often do you go to Tim Hortons League? Like every hour. How many coffees do you drink a day usually? Um, about one large in the morning and then usually an extra large or another large in the evening and then maybe a decaf um, before you go to bed. How often a week do you drink Tim Hortons? Uh, at least five times a week. About uh, three times a week here. How often do you drink Tim Hortons a week? Uh, maybe once a, once a day. Uh, you too? Yeah. Get here and get my Timmy's. Now with so many students hot for coffee, you gotta wonder, what's it like for the folks behind the counter? The customers are amazing. I find, and I've worked in customer service before, in the college atmosphere, definitely the students are so nice and more than forgiving if you uh, make a mistake. Everybody there is drinking coffee right now. We all do. We're all ITers, so we live off coffee. The other question everyone's been wondering is, does Tim Hortons make you smarter? I feel very happy. I'm gonna go to class and concentrate and get straight A's, yo. Well, it keeps me uh, not tired. <laughs> it does help me concentrate more, and when I have my coffee first thing in the morning, I usually feel a lot more relaxed. And I'm one of those people that I've been drinking coffee for so long that the more I drink more coffee, the more relaxed I get. <laughs> okay. Um, it helps. Uh, focus on class and concentration. Uh, probably around lunch, around noon hour, actually just after lunch. Uh, a lot of people come in to get coffee after that. Yeah. The line behind me is pretty long. I talk to students about whether this ever bothers them. Here? Yeah, in the mornings. It's brutal. It goes probably out to the junction at some times. And for such a Canadian company, what about the idea of being able to pay with Canadian tire money? We don't accept Canadian tire money, unfortunately. Uh, the two haven't met as of yet. There is no conglomeration. But uh, hey, maybe I'll bring it to the higher ups, see what we can do. A the conglomeration there. In poll after poll, Tim Hortons ranks as Canada's favorite coffee place. From Kelowna to Kandahar, it's a way that Canadians start their day off nice and fresh. I think I might just go grab a hot cup myself. For On Campus, I'm Paul Bryan.